DMOS with HBCU Connect. I've got DMOS with me, my right hand man. Yo, and we're yo. out here. <laughs> so we're out here. Uh, we're about to go meet with the folks at YouTube and uh, Google. They've got some great opportunities. We want to solidify that relationship. We guys, we, we actually want you guys to see that this is a real thing. HBCU Connect is going hard in the paint to try to find opportunities for African-American professionals and HBCU students and HBCU graduates. So make sure you stay tuned, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and you can take this journey with us. We're actually starting here in San Francisco. We're gonna go meet with you, the folks at YouTube and uh, Google. And then we're flying up to San Diego and we're gonna actually attend a conference to try to get some more jobs and opportunities from um, higher ed. So those of you that are interested in going into careers in higher ed, we've got you. Those of you that are interested in going into careers in the corporate world, we've got you covered with YouTube opportunities and Google opportunities. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and subscribe to hbcuconnect.com. And then also, we're gonna then fly up to meet with the folks at Amazon. So we're out here on the West Coast. Um, like I said, this is Will Moss with hbcuconnect.com. Um, and yeah, so we're gonna fly up to Seattle. We're gonna meet with the folks at Amazon and talk about some opportunities that they have to share with the HBCU audience, the students that are graduating, students that are looking for internships, and then graduates that are already out there, uh, especially, you know, since, um, you know, a lot of organizations are looking for HBCU graduates um, for opportunities and they come to HBCU Connect to make that happen. So from time to time, we like to go meet face to face, discuss what their current needs are, and then present those needs and opportunities to you, our audience on HBCUConnect.com. So please stay tuned. Please subscribe to our YouTube and join us on this journey on the West Coast to meet with YouTube, Google, uh, the College and University Personnel Administration, as well as Amazon. Will Moss and I'm out. <music>
we just came out. Um, we weren't allowed to videotape on the inside of the building, but it's legit. That's the bam bam. It's legit. You want to show them yours? Yeah, I think I got mine in here too. Oh, check it out. Swag. Got a swag bag. There you go. And these are the three buildings on campus. So YouTube has three here in. Yeah, one. Two over there, 901 Cherry. It's two over there, right? And thousand, just these oh, yeah. three. And 1,000. So 900, 901, and 1,000 right Everybody's down there. Everybody's catching the Uber from work. But, uh, so as you guys know, YouTube is actually has been owned for by Google for some time now. So it's actually, out, we're actually out here with YouTube and Google. But, uh, had a wonderful tour by our hostess. Go ahead and rep that HBCU. Oh, yeah. The bright. HBCU, HBCU connect. connect. Get connected. You know, show them your swag yeah, bag. Yeah, I got we my got swag, swag bag. So why do um why are you get why are we out here at YouTube and why are you got the swag bag from YouTube and everything? So we're out here visiting YouTube and Google because HBCU Connect, as many of you know, is a fantastic platform for recruiting organizations who are trying to tap into the best some of the best talent from black colleges. It's a fantastic platform for these hiring organizations to connect with the talent that they're looking for. In this case, YouTube and by extension Google, their parent company, are looking for talented HBCU grads. So what better way to make that Let's happen? Walk by the sign. So what better way to make that happen to, than to actually come out here, meet with the folks who are looking for the talent, find out what their needs are across the boards so that we can take it back to home back home and strategize on the best ways to deliver talent to YouTube and Google. So that's what we're here for and uh, we're very excited about some of the things that we're going to be up to for Yugle and uh, for Yugle, for Yugle, Yugle, for Yugle, Yugle, that's you people through Google <laughs> Yugle. or YouTube Google. There it is. So that's what we're here Out today. here in California. Shout out to everybody at HBCU Connect. Please subscribe to our new YouTube channel. We want to show YouTube that the HBCU community is in full effect and that they need to continue to invest in the HBCU community and making sure that they provide job opportunities to folks coming out of the HBCUs and those who are already out in the workforce with a degree from an HBCU. So subscribe to that channel so we can show YouTube how big the HBCU audience is and how connected we are and let's make it happen. We got opportunities coming from uh, from YouTube and Google, man, some really good opportunities, software engineering opportunities, human resources opportunities, of course, business, finance, accounting, all of the good stuff that makes the wheels keep turning at any business like YouTube. So we invite you guys to subscribe to hbcuconnect.com, of course, but also subscribe to our new YouTube channel. This is Will Moss. And Daniel Moss. Signing out. So we'll holler back at you guys. We gotta get something to eat. It's a little bit of behind the scenes footage. We're trying to eat healthier. I think there's a movement with that healthier eating thing. So let's see if I can not eat any <laughs> junk today. So far we're doing pretty good. Hey, popcorn. <laughs> right. But uh, nah, appreciate you guys signing out. We'll, we'll get back with you guys in, a, in just a moment. So we're back. Just got back to the hotel from the trip to YouTube and Google. It was a good trip overall. Great trip. Good people. You can, they got a special vibe. YouTube is the truth, man. YouTube is going places. So make sure you guys stay tuned so we can share their opportunities, subscribe, but great trip so far. So this is the beginning of a, of a three-part journey to West Coast, Google YouTube today, and then uh, tomorrow heading up San Diego for a Google conference, which is College and University Personnel Administration. So opportunities with, uh, within higher ed all over the country. Stay tuned for that. And then after that conference, we're going to shoot up to uh, Seattle to meet with Amazon. So shout out to the folks at Amazon, and thanks for having us up there. And you guys just make sure you look out for some great opportunities from those companies. HBCU Connect, get connected.
We'll see you later. Hey, hey, HBCU Connect family. It's your boy, Will Moss, my brother here. D Moss, what's poppin'? So, we are in San Diego for HBCU Connect for the Koopa HR Conference. In case you guys don't know what that is, it is the largest conference for college and university personnel, administrators, and administrators. So, why are we here? We are trying to connect with more colleges and universities that want to hire members from HBCU Connect. So basically, we got you guys to connect. So, check it out. So we're here at the uh, Cooper HR Conference. We've got uh, Daniel Moss there ready. So this is what it looks like. We're, we're here at the conference and uh, we are going to connect with some employers of choice from the college and university atmosphere. And um, if you're interested in working in higher ed, make sure you sign up for hbcuconnect.com and browse the jobs on our website, okay? Because we're here putting in work for you guys. This is Will Moss, here with my brother Daniel Moss, representing HBCU Connect. We've got our little booth set up, having lunch. Ah, look, it connected. So we're here at the conference. Check it out. So this is Will Moss, CEO of HBCUConnect.com. And I just wanted to say thank you to everybody that uh, has subscribed to hbcuconnect.com over the years, all of the graduates from the HBCUs, all of the students from the HBCUs, all of the high school students that are considering their college options. I just wanna say thank you. It's been a pleasure going to work for you guys over the last, man, 18 years of my life. I've been dedicated to building out hbcuconnect.com, dedicated to trying to find opportunities for the students and graduates at the HBCUs. And just, it's been a pleasure, and I would not be able to follow my passion, you know, with working for HBCU Connect and running this company if it were not for you guys that have taken the time out to become members, taking the time out to check out the opportunities that we bring to the table, and to, you know, essentially go on the website and poke around and have fun, reconnect with your classmates. So, I just wanna say I appreciate that, and um, love you guys, sincerely. So, you guys probably don't hear from me a lot, kind of, a behind the scenes type of person, but I'm starting to realize the power of video, finally, and uh, really gonna try to put a honest effort towards creating more video content for the members of hbcuconnect.com. So thank you, we love you, we appreciate you, we welcome you, and please communicate with us, communicate with me. You guys have my email address, my direct email address is wrmoss at hbcuconnect.com. Simple as that. If you have ideas for the website, if you'd like to see us do more things, put more types, different types of content, certain types of jobs, whatever it might be, you have a direct line of communication to me. And um, just wanted to say I appreciate you. So that's it. You know, we're in San Diego again for the College and University Personnel Administration Conference, trying to connect with colleges and universities that are interested in hiring more African-American professionals so that we can bring their opportunities to you. That's what we're here for. So, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. HBCU Connect, get connected. Hey, what's up YouTube? What's up HBCU Connect? It's your boy Will Moss. We're here at Amazon's headquarters in Seattle, downtown Seattle as a matter of fact. 
and you might ask, what are we doing here at Amazon? I'm here with my brother Daniel Moss, chief people person at HBCU Connect. So what are we doing? We're actually meeting with the folks at Amazon to talk about career opportunities for the HBCU audience. So if you're an HBCU student, an HBCU grad, or an African American that uses, utilizes HBCUConnect.com, we are here going to bat for you to present Amazon's opportunities to the students at the HBCUs that are graduating or looking for internships, and also for the alumni of HBCUs to take advantage of career opportunities at Amazon in all areas of operations, retail, the website, um, all, over the, all over the company. So as you can see, huge headquarters here in Seattle, Washington. And, uh, you know, we're on, a, we're on our West Coast tour. Where is it? The jump. There it is. <laughs> Get connected. Get connected. HBCU Connect. This is it. We've, uh, our West Coast trip is coming to an end. Ending in Seattle. Um, after meeting today, very productive meeting with Amazon. And, uh. Any final words before we get on that plane? Oh man, it doesn't happen unless you make it happen. So, you gotta be in the mix. Um, you gotta be in the mix to make it stick. <laughs> but no, uh, get out there, pursue your dreams. Don't take no for an answer. Go to where the action is. I got something for you. Or make some action yourself. So, a lot of people might be wondering, how do we get a meeting with Amazon, right? A lot of small businesses would like to work with a big company like that. And to be honest, as a result of us putting in years and years and years of hard work, um, doing what we do with integrity, doing what we say we're gonna do, having a good reputation. And then once you build a relationship with people, with, with someone at one of these companies, um, a lot of times what happens is you do good work and you do hard work for them wherever they are. When they when they grow, you grow with them. So um, actually one of our, our um, key contacts that we work with at Microsoft, um, contacted and reached out, reached out to us when he went to Amazon and um, as a result of his moving to Amazon and all the work we did for him when he was at Microsoft he brought us over to to look at a relationship with Amazon so um, so of course when you get opportunities like that put your best foot forward and go to work you know what I mean go to work focus and go to work and uh, do everything in your power to do what you say you're going to do and be responsible for whatever you promise. So that's, you know, something to think about for all you entrepreneurs and small business folks out there that are wondering how we got to this point. Um, but, uh, you know, take care of the people that take care of you. All right. Another point there is that often in, in building relationships where transactions are concerned, the margins may start out relatively small but you know everything you know you, you use those that early rapport as a foothold and the early work as a foothold to do more you know and you get an opportunity to expand on the relationship and the payout grows hopefully in tandem to the work that you put in along the way but um, a lot of that early work comes come at great sacrifice but if you stick to it with the idea that you want to provide the best service that you can along the way to whoever the client or partner may be it usually pays off and sometimes the reward is not in money or dollars but sometimes in intangibles and if, if you don't leave room for um, and aren't looking for those rewards in whatever carnation they might find them in whatever way they might present themselves sometimes you miss them but stay open to recognize the benefit and the 
value that you receive from, from each new relationship and each new opportunity. Holla back. Yeah. We out of here.